Younger children could start receiving COVID-19 vaccines later this week. This comes after the FDA authorized shots for kids ages 5 to 11. The White House says the Biden administration is already assembling and shipping millions of doses of Pfizer's vaccine, so they're ready to go once the CDC gives full approval. We know the possibility of vaccines for our children will be a welcome relief for many families. And we also know parents will have a lot of questions. And I would encourage parents to ask questions as they consider the benefits of vaccinating their children. A special advisory panel to the CDC is expected to meet tomorrow. Now hospitals across our area are gearing up to roll out those vaccines. Shelly Boards talked with parents today to find out how eager they are to get their children vaccinated. Shelly, what are you hearing about this today? Well, I caught up with some parents enjoying this beautiful day at the park with their kids. And while they all tell me that the vaccine is a good thing, they do have some concerns. I'd like to get some more information. Um, see if they really need it and how much it works. Nick Osman has two sons who fit into the latest category of Americans to be approved to get the COVID-19 vaccine. Children ages 5 to 11. His oldest is 7 and his youngest will be 5 in 3 days. But Osman tells me he's not running to the pediatrician to get either of them vaccinated anytime soon. I'm just nervous about being the first ones. You don't know how it goes and um, I mean it's just more information and make sure it's safe for everybody. The FDA approved the Pfizer vaccine for the 5 to 11 age group on Friday. The company said its low dose vaccine is a third of the dosage given to adults and is more than 90% effective in preventing symptomatic infection. Today, local hospitals are just waiting for the green light from the CDC to go ahead with public distribution, which could come tomorrow. In a statement to KDKA News, UPMC says in part, UPMC leaders are preparing for this final federal guidance to come this week. And if approved, we will quickly put plans into place to vaccinate the 5 to 11 age group. Meanwhile, patients tell KDKA News they have already made appointments for their kids to be vaccinated at their doctor's offices as early as next week. Osmond tells me it makes him more confident knowing the federal government is taking all the right steps before offering the vaccine to children. He says it's just something he and his wife will have to discuss before making a final decision. I got the vaccine as soon as I could because I didn't want to get sick, but I don't know how, if they need it or not. So if I get some more information, and we'll think it over and see what's right. UPMC tells me they're holding a press briefing Friday morning to discuss various topics, including COVID vaccines for children. Reporting live tonight, I'm Shelley Bortz for KDKA News. Thanks, Shelley.